So about a week ago, we discussed about NHL 23 may not be on next-gen consoles, and I got some feedback from you guys, and it's uh, it's awesome feedback, and I really do appreciate it. And I do see the other side of it where there, consoles are very hard to get right now. The current-gen consoles are very hard to get, the Xbox Series X and the PS5. It's a little bit easier to get the Xbox Series X and Series S than it is the PS5 because Microsoft bought... Um, bought the chip order they bought the the bulk of the main chips that build these consoles and everything like that so microsoft has priority in that range when it comes down to building the consoles but that's not what the whole video is about i understand that it is very hard to get a next gen console in reality i was very lucky to get an xbox series x right on launch day when i did pre-order mine um, I recently got a PS5. I just, my mom just walked into the store and asked for one and they had one and we bought it. Um, but other than that, I do understand where the other view is coming from with it's hard to find the next gen console, but, uh, that's not what we're going to talk about today. What we're going to talk about today is who's going to be on the cover of NHL 23. Now there is a lot of candidates happening for the NHL 23 cover. Um, now, obviously, with, with Europe, may have a different cover athlete than the North American version of NHL 23. But if we look at the NHL website currently, um, who who is the best candidate? Who do you guys think is the best candidate when it comes down to the NHL 23 cover? Now, obviously, we don't want to see we don't want to see the same same person on the cover again. We want to see different players. Um, I was kind of pissed off having the exact same uh, player on the cover uh, this year. I was I was kind of pissed off, but um, anyways. So right now, the person that's leading the points in the regular season of NHL of 2021 and 2022 is obviously Connor McDavid, 108 points. Um, Jonathan Huberdeau is up there with 104. Leon Drysaddle is 101. Austin Matthews, 99, uh, Johnny Goudreau, 99, Mitch Marner, 90, Matthew Kachuk, ew, 89, I'm, j I'm joking, I don't like, I, personally, I do not like Matthew Kachuk, um, but, um, anyways, uh, but anyways, so the top three people could be on the cover of NHL 23, now that's just points. Now going with goals, Austin Matthews number one, Leon Dreisaitl is number two, and uh, Alex Ovechkin's down in fourth. Really? Alex Ovechkin's down in fourth for goals? Jeez. Um, but looking at the rookies, also there could be a rookie on the cover, uh, like Zegras and like these amazing rookies that are actually coming up into the NHL, and also. There's one person that has not been on the cover of any NHL game. That is Sidney Crosby. But he said in the past, he does not want to be on the cover of NHL, of EA Sports NHL. He doesn't want to be on the cover at all. So, it's very unlikely that we'll see him on the cover of NHL 23. Because he does not want to be on the cover of NHL at all. So... People that want Sidney Crosby on the cover, he's not going to be on the cover unless he comes out saying like he's going to retire or something. Then maybe he could be on um, the cover of NHL 23 if he is retiring or he does change his mind when it comes down to the cover. Because I think a lot of people, a lot of people have kind of a thing attached to the cover of being just... A bad omen when it comes down to it now Austin Matthews obviously is not struggling with that in the goals but he is kind of uh, he is kind of struggling in the points but he's mostly focused on goals Mitch Marner is probably passing in the puck a uh, quite a lot here if we actually look at the assists yeah he's got 59 assists with Austin Matthews getting 58 goals so it kind of seems it kind of seems like Austin Matthews is obviously getting passes quite a lot and he's being open quite a lot and the defenders are not really 
doing their job. Um, but we could see Mitch Marner on the cover. I would love to see Mitch Marner on the cover. He's a very popular guy. He's a very awesome guy and um, and everything like that. And coming down to the points, Connor McDavid has already been on the cover. I would like to see somebody different every single year on the cover. Unfortunately, NHL kind of broke that record um, with, uh, with Austin Matthews. Um, but... Um, yeah, we could see, I would love to see Leon Dreisettle, maybe a goalie. I would love to see a goalie on the cover once again. There's only been, I'm pretty sure, one goalie on the cover of NHL, and I believe that's Martin Bardur. It's only been on the cover of NHL. Um, I forget what year it was, but maybe somebody can correct me in the comments below. I know somebody will. Um, will give me the proper year. I think it was 09? It was 09 or 010? I'm pretty sure. It was around that time, 09, 010. Um, but I would love to see somebody completely different. Maybe, like I said, maybe a rookie. Maybe um, maybe a rookie or maybe a referee that is very, very popular in the NHL. And uh, with his calls and everything like that, when it comes down to penalties and um, everything like that, when he yells, uh, too much tripping, like he yells it to the crowd and everybody loves him. Every NHL player loves him. Also, he's been also in the um, uh, the All Star games too. He's been the referee for the All Star games and everything like that. So, I would love to, maybe maybe a ref to throw that in. Um, but um, yeah, I would love to see somebody different on the cover. Me personally, I would love to see maybe uh, Trevor Zegras. Uh, obviously, doing amazing on the Anaheim Ducks. He's absolutely doing amazing as a rookie already 53 points in this season and he's got um he's got 20 goals already and that's pretty good on, on for being on the ducks and everything like that the, the position that uh the team is currently in um i'm pretty sure they are rebuilding um i am an anaheim ducks fan and i believe they are rebuilding um ryan getzlav actually announces a retirement this year so we might see him on the cover He's been on the Ducks ever since he's got drafted by the Ducks. And I would love to see him on the cover. I would love to see an Anaheim Duck on the cover of NHL 23. But you guys can let me know in the comments below on what you guys would like to see on the cover of NHL 23. Like I said, maybe a goalie. I would love to see a goalie once again. I give you guys my picks. Give me your guys' top three picks if you guys would like to see on the cover of NHL 23. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys smash the like button. Make sure you guys subscribe. If you guys haven't already, my name is Justin or Prez, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Looking for change, looking for pain. Pulling a mob, pushing a train. I'll never stop, stick to a lane. Pick up the pieces and go rearrange. I'll be the best above all the rest. Put me to the test. Yeah. Expect nothing less, you check as I'm chess, what's happening next, yeah. He got the venom, a tangible weapon, no coming in second, this life is a lesson He got a new engine from pain, it's a blessing, new focus, no guessing Just bold an obsession, all in his possession, you got the retention I leave an impression and take a redemption, just kill no discretion Your mind is a weapon, 11-11, it's time for progression